and my booze are just spillage just everywhere it just ta-ta is just in the wind hi guys it's your girl being natasha nicole here and welcome back to my channel where we focus on god glowing and growing you know what i mean so if you ain't a subscriber already you need to i mean if you want to elevate your life that's what we do over here um join the peep squad because y'all my people y'all know y'all are so anyway today is the first day well i mean happy new year first off happy new year but this is the first vlog of the year y'all the first one 2022 i hope it's being good to you already but today is um today is january third <laughs> today is january third um i just got a little bit dressed today you would think i had on foundation but i'm in the process of finding a um just like a everyday kind of like a everyday look routine or everyday quick makeup routine but i do not have on foundation so i'm working on putting that together so it's gonna be some great content coming this year uh but right now i actually just got dressed and carter and i are about to go to waffle house because he's starving uh he does have his first basketball game today um there's a few things i need to take back to the store i need to go by ulta and maybe run a few more errands i know there's a few more things that i need to kind of pick up but yeah, so I just decided to take y'all along with me because today is Monday. They are still out of school. They don't actually go back to school until tomorrow, until Tuesday. Um, but as y'all seen in my last vlog, I had the vid all Christmas. So we just out trying to just do something, spruce myself up to feel better. I am now COVID free. So yeah, we're good with <laughs> baby put on your mask and stay safe because it's 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 a cold cold world out here speaking of cold like it's getting cold and it's been so warm since christmas like it's been ridiculously warm like i said lord is you coming is you coming because it's a little warm outside and they say you know revelations say you won't be able to tell the difference between the seasons so i ain't scared get your life together and you won't be either but anyway that's besides the point so until jesus decides to make his arrival um yeah we're just getting a few things in today and i just wanted to go ahead and bring y'all along with me i will continue to do the weekly vlogs throughout the year um here and there i can't promise you that they will be every week because some weeks are better than others and sometimes i have some things going on but bay and i want to start traveling a little bit more this year Depending on COVID, we've been waiting on COVID. We need to make wedding plans. We need to get married. Um, we're working on that too. I think we finally got a date, which he chose because it's just to the point. I, I really don't care about what the date is, honestly. I just know that I just wanted kind of like a winter conda cooler outside. I didn't want no summer wedding, baby. It's too hot and that dress is too hot and I'm gonna be sweaty. So I want a cooler thing and there's always something going on somebody's birthday or something we can't do. Our birthdays are in the same month in April. So is our grandson. So we was like, we definitely can't vacation around our birthday because Tylen, you know, this would be the first year he'd be one this year. So yeah, if you didn't know, I'm a grandma. Actually, I'm not a grandma. I'm a Nana. I'm a Nana. But Jay's oldest daughter had a baby last year and it's a blessing. I love him so much. I love him. And that's my daughter too because we're getting married. So that's my baby. That's my Nana. That's Nana's boy right there. But anyway, yeah, so we finally picked a date and everything. But I'm going to stop rambling because my son's hungry. So we're going to go ahead and go to Waffle House, get something to eat, and we're going to run a few errands. Um, and I did flexi rods for the first time in my hair. And y'all... Let me find out I can flexi ride my hair. Let me find out. But anyway, just a quick um, outfit look. Something very super basic. I don't even think, it don't even really match that well. But um, anyway, I just have on this shirt from Walmart. Just a Fast and Furious shirt. Mom jeans from Walmart 
if you ever seen those on TikTok, they went viral and I do love them. They're high rise mom jeans. I absolutely love these pants. And then I just have on my uh, Pumas. So yeah, just something comfortable because we're just running a few errands and stuff today. So we'll get that done. And yeah, so let's go ahead and get to Waffle House. <laughs> And y'all, my mom, my mom has COVID too, so she, all the packages that were at my house, she came and dropped them off. <laughs> I had no idea that I had so many packages, so we got to open up all these. I think some of those are still kind of Carter's Christmas presents that he still need to open. Um, But yeah, we're opening these packages today. I had no idea. I knew she put them in my car, but I didn't know it was going to take up this much room, but yeah, we got to do that today. <laughs> I see lights are flashing paparazzi I touch on your girl, she want my snap so she can at me Pull on that loud, I'm hikey high but I move low key She turn on a whiskey just to show me how to shock you Don't do it for the money Alright, so um, Carter and I just got finished eating at um, Waffle House Those bags in the back of my car looks horrible So now we're about to, uh, we're here at Walmart and we're gonna grab a few things I know I said I was going to Ulta and Marshalls and uh, I think I was going to Burlington but I think I'm gonna wait till actually Carter goes to school tomorrow and so then I'm kind of like free I think we're just gonna stay around the area today versus um quite out of town yeah besides doing that um just so I have a little bit more freedom and I can take my time and kind of shop and look because he ain't with it no. um <laughs> So we about to go in here to Walmart yeah. and hush. We about to go in here to Walmart and then go to um, Sally's too, cause there's a few things that I need. I had made a. Oh my god! Oh, I didn't leave. I thought I left my phone. I was gonna say, did I leave my phone at Waffle House? I was about to go back. But um, I had made me a list of a few things that I actually needed here out of Walmart, which is like nothing major. Yeah, just a few things that I need out of here. Just like basic things um, that I need to get. Then I want to go back to the house and put on my nails because... Yeah, I need to do something to my nails because they look horrible. But anyway, so we're going to go ahead and go in here to Walmart. Grab a few things and run into Sally's and then we do more of the run around tomorrow so actually today it'd be cut Emma. short besides you know going to his basketball game we can go home and open up some of these packages see what that is so -E yeah that's what we're about to do so let's go ahead you got your mask on buddy put our mask on no go into Walmart and the way that I did my face, this is going to be a great way. I'm going to wear this face for a few days to kind of see if this is going to be my everyday routine. Especially with wearing these masks again, honey. But you got to have on your mask because it's so freaking important. So we're going to go ahead and do this. Um, and yeah. Walmart. My phone rings, a girl tryna link up oh, yeah. I got dank, get juice, we can drink up oh, yeah. Get high, get waved to the ting done ting Good done. girl, she made time for a demon Yeah, yeah, for a demon, demon. I don't play tricks, no. be cool off with the Netflix. Netflix I got my eyes on the next bits My girl, man, I don't miss don't I done miss. dada, no novice oh, The next stop for the trophies You should know this You see I'm golden, shining, floating Gosh, I don't care. All this stuff. <laughs> Thank you, babe, for saving the day. Carter, don't drag it. That's your PlayStation stuff in there. 
Yeah. <laughs> look there at, you go. Look at it. Curls there you for go. the girls. Curls for the girls. <laughs> All right. Woo! So we are back at home. Ugh. Sinking. Okay. So I finally just got back home. And I guess I'll go ahead and show you what I got from Walmart right quick. Um, like I said, we end up not going to... Oh, I need some lip gloss. <sighs> okay. Had to call some more lip gloss right quick. But, um, yeah, so I just got back home. And like I said, my neighbors, God, they're so loud. But like I said, I end up not going to Ulta and Marshalls and Burlington and all that because just decided I'm just going to go tomorrow when my son's in school so I'm not like rushing and I can have time to shop like I want to. So at Walmart just now, I just got a few things, a few necessities, things that I really needed. Uh, first off, I got some um, nail polish remover. I got the acetone as well as the non-acetone um, because my toes... They look real crusty dusty. I ain't even gonna lie. Like my toes look absolutely freaking poor. Rub off. Girl, it started like a French tip on my big toe. So I just gotta get that going because that's not how it's supposed to look and it looks really bad. Um, I also got some of my Kiss lashes. These are my favorite ones. These lashes that I have ran out of and they are the number 11 Kiss. These are like some of the best lashes, especially if you're like a, um, like a beginner or if you just like nice wispy lashes and they look super super natural not beginner but you know i mean if you're new to wearing lashes these are really close to looking like really natural lashes people will be like are those your lashes like they look so good I'm like girl no not my lashes but people think they are all the time um i just went ahead and got me some fingernail files because like i said i'm gonna do my nails and those nails too, you can buy those at Walmart too, so. Yeah, I mean, they be lit. And then I just went ahead and got me um, some Sally Hansen, Hansen Insta Dry. I'm sorry if I sound real stuffy still, but uh, I got the clear and the white to redo my pedicure. Because they look really, really crusty dusty. Uh, and what else I get from Walmart? Also from Walmart, oh. I bought these joggers. These are the no boundary, the slim fit. These are actually out of the um, men's section, but they are very, very comfy. Um, yeah, they just go with anything. And I, I like these joggers because I have these in uh, kind of like a acid kind of wash, black and bleachy looking color, but I like these and so they go with anything. So I bought these and these are only like $15.97 actually. So yeah, don't sleep on the men's section of Walmart, boo. So, we're gonna go ahead and open these packages. And then, yeah. So, honestly, I don't even remember what I ordered. I know I ordered some stuff off Just Fab um, because I have so many Just Fab credits, it's ridiculous. So I just went ahead and ordered some things. I ordered some stuff off Amazon. I can't even remember what I ordered. <laughs> so sad. This is like Christmas all over again when my mom brings packages. So this first package is on top. This is from, is this just Fab? This is just Fab. Make sure my address ain't showing. So we're gonna see what's in this package without cutting the package. Because I have done that before, opening a package and like cut what was on the inside, which is so bad. All right. I don't even remember what I ordered, girl. Oh yeah, I ordered some heels. I ordered some heels. So first off, I ordered this. I don't know what this is. Did I say I needed a tote? Why did I need a tote? What is this? Oh yeah, I guess I kind of could use it. So I got this, I thought it was bigger. I got this tote, it's kind of like a leopard looking. I bought this because I figured like this is like kind of a week ender bag. What is the name? I don't even know the name of this. No, all this stuff has like different names on it. 
It doesn't really say. But, um, and it comes with a long strap. But this is just kind of like a weekender bag. You know, if you just need to put some stuff in. It's great if you're a stripper. <laughs> like, it's just like a tote bag like this. So, I just figure, you know, if I'm just going somewhere real quick or something. I don't know why I got in this leopard color. I don't know why I bought it. But it does have a few pockets on the front. Oh, it has the pocket for like the bag. So this is a travel bag. So you can stick it on top of the handle of your like carry on or your luggage. So you can put it on the back of there. So that's pretty cute. So I mean, we are going to Jamaica this year. So I guess I could use it. Maybe that's why I bought it. So I guess I just use this as a carry on and it has leather on the bottom. So I bought it. Okay. This pair of shoes, this is in the, this is a heeled boot. This is the Janessa. And I bought these in a size 12. So. Oh my God. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Yeah, so I bought these in a size 12. I think this is the, This is not, this is not the boot that I ordered. Oh, they sent me some impressed nails. Well, was I not just talking about these? Look at that. Just Fab sent me some in the packaging. So that's pretty dope. We'll be using those. Um, so I bought these boots. Yes, okay. I was about to say, these are not the boots I ordered. But these are the thigh high boots, baby. I'm so excited to wear these. These are going to be so cute. These are a look. I want to um, almost put on like a hoodie and these boots and just let it be a look. And I want to take a picture for Instagram. I ain't even going to lie. But yeah, I bought these in this kind of boot. And it doesn't have like a really tall heel on it. But um, in the boots that are kind of like pointy toe, I have to order them one size up so i'm usually like a size 11 10 and a half 11 but i ordered them in a 12 because um that the toe is like so tapered that my toe just doesn't fit well in the size 11 that i have so i ordered these every time i see boots like this i'm always going to size up a little bit so these are cute um also this package is from amazon of course not quite sure what's in here Oh, oh, this is a sponsorship. I forgot. I forgot I had hair coming. So this is a hair. So I'm actually unbox this on camera later for a separate video. I'm not gonna do it right now. I forgot that this sponsor sent me some hair. Oh, the package, which is from Just Fab as well. And if I remember correctly, these are just some more um, pointy toe boots. Yeah, but these are like the booties. Where's my address? Okay. This one is in, these are the Roseman Black and I got these in a size 12 as well. More nails. I'm gonna have plenty of nails to wear, that's for sure. But I actually already had these boots, but I had them in a size 11 and honestly, they just hurt. They, they hurt so bad, which is why I said I was gonna size up. Like something's on it. I know you see that on my boot. Can you see that? Anywho, whatever. So I got this boot right here, but I got it in a size 12. So I'm hoping that this will fit a whole lot better than my other pair that was in a size 11. Actually, size 11. So I'm hoping we're gonna try all these shoes on in a minute, but. Hopefully, I'm um, hoping that these feel a whole lot better. I'm mad about the scuff mark on the side, or I know you see that right there. Like this, this cap right there. But anyway, I got these, these are cute, but we just sized up. And my other ones that I actually have, cause <clears throat> while I was out with the, with the bid, 
I end up, since I was trapped in my room, I end up just kind of cleaning up my whole room and like purging some stuff to go into the new year because I believe in having a super clean house when the new year comes in. So everything in my house was spotless, closets were cleaned out, stuff was purged out everywhere. From my room to Carter's room. And then last I got the booties. Oh, and I got these in a size 12. These are the Rosemen, so they're exact same thing, but I got them in white. This so reminds me, these didn't have no scuff. <laughs> I feel like these are like a go-go boot. I don't know where I'm gonna wear these to or with, but I got them in white because I thought they were just so cute. And they're kind of like this patent leather. So I know that they'll wash off really well. They're not suede like the black ones are. So I got these in a size 12 and I don't know what I'm gonna wear with these, but I feel like this is a look, it's a classic shoe. So it's like, it's not going nowhere, you know? It's a classic shoe that I could wear later because I may not even get around to wearing those this year. So three pair of shoes. Um, we also got something else from Amazon. is not what I ordered. Oh, compressed facial sponges. Maybe this is what I ordered. So I ordered some of these, um, maybe once you wet them. I bought some of these just because uh, Peyton Char Charles is always using like these um, sponges to kind of like help exfoliate her face. And I thought maybe if I had these sponges, maybe I wouldn't have to use like I use the St. Ives um, exfoliating scrub. I know a lot of people don't like that because they say it's very harsh and on their skin. So I was thinking maybe if I'm like using these every day, then maybe they won't be so bad, but maybe they, they're compressed. But I'm hoping hers look kind of bigger and like thicker. So I'm hoping by the time these hit water that they swell up. If not, I ordered the wrong thing. But she said you can find a pack of 50 for like $9 and they had a pack of 50 for like $9. So I guess that's what that is. And then last but not least, our Etsy package. I've been waiting on this because Etsy is lit. I like Etsy. I even did the Glam, Glam Bag X because um, I don't know if this is a Glam Bag X, but um, this is a subscription. Etsy is a subscription that you can actually do. And I believe it's like $29.99 a month. And quarterly, I'm charged like $55. And you get more products or better products or full-size products or whatever. But um, this one, I like the bag. You get these little bags and they're really cute. You can always do whatever. I usually end up giving them away or putting something in them. But this time, let's see what we got in this bag. We got a lactic acid plus hyaluronic acid. This is a glow moisturizer. And this is by Kate Somerville. I don't know if you can see that. But this is like a, just a moisturizer. And I like this subscription because I'm able to try different stuff. Mmm, it smells good. It smells good. But, um... I'm able to just try some different stuff and I found some serums because they send a lot of facial care stuff. A lot of serums and stuff that they buy, uh, send me, I love them. And the stuff that I really don't use, um, Maya's getting older. If y'all don't know, Maya is uh, like my stepdaughter that is Carter's uh, older sister, but I've been around her since she was three. You know, you leave the man to keep the kid. That's what I did. So now that she's like, she's about to be 16 this year. And I've been around her since she was three, but now she's starting to kind of get into makeup and stuff. So just this past Christmas, she's in my room just going through my makeup and stuff. And I just let her take, you know, I have like a drawer of Etsy stuff that I don't necessarily use at the moment or just haven't gotten to. So I let her, I just kind of put everything in that drawer and just let her kind of pick and choose what she may want out of there because I haven't used it yet. And she's starting to get into makeup because she's older. So, yeah. Um, we also got... Roller gloss. It says nails 
ink, but what do you do with it? The lip glosses. They say they're uh, these two, they look like this. So they're actually lip glosses, but they're two crystal ball lip glosses infused with real crystals to stimulate lip circulation and wake up the chakras. Notice the real crystal roller ball application designed to cool and soothe lips as they roll. Um, so, so yeah, they're just some lip glosses and one of them is like, Chris has crystals in it, which is pretty darn cool. Okay. Some crystal lip glosses. <laughs> Maya. I may like them. As long as they thick. That Mario Badesco though, lip gloss. If your lip gloss ain't thick like Mario Badesco, I don't want it, baby. Oh, I also got a clay mask, a detox mask. I hope this is like the green tea that you see everybody using. No, it's not in that. But this is just like a clay mask, detox, tightening, um, glacial oceanic clay. So I would definitely keep that. I love the face mask because I'm trying to do a face mask. I try to do them like three times a week, but honey, listen, Lizzie. Uh, Dragon Beauty Liquid Eyeliner. Been needing this. They also send a lot of Archelli products, which I've never heard of until I start getting this bag. But their brow stuff, their eyeliners, their felted tip eyeliner, lit. So this is a Dragon Beauty one, and this is a felted tip liner. You see that? Oh my god. Oh, and it glides on. Yes, and it ain't even moving. I'm gonna love this, I already know. This is by Dragon Beauty and this is just a liquid eyeliner. Won't be giving that away. And then last but not least, we have Studio Makeup Volume Intense Mascara. It says limited edition. Ooh, this is heavy. This is just a volumizing intense mascara. Oh, this looks very professional and it has a kind of brush that I like that's just kind of like the spoolie kind of brush. I like that just like the Tarte um, one. I've gotten Fenty, I've gotten Tarte, I've gotten Fenty and Tarte in the Etsy bags like eyeliners, mascaras, and full sizes. So this is pretty dope and I like the way this packaging feels and it's this thing is heavy bro. I'm gonna beat somebody up with that. <laughs> but anyway, so yeah, that's all we got in our Etsy bag. So I guess we didn't have too, too many packages. It looks like most of it was just from Just Fab. And we do got some new hair. Which I need to do an unboxing, but I'll probably do that tomorrow. So that's that. But So I told y'all I'll see y'all at the basketball game. But actually, I'm in Carter's room to hook up to hook up this um this driving game that my mom bought him the stern wheel and everything I'm so excited i used to have one of these as a kid and i think i'm just like obsessed at the moment with having one so i'm gonna sit y'all over here while i set it up He's putting the game and everything together. So I'm just excited to play it. And he has this little desk right here to put it on. Oh, yes, baby. Oh, I'm so excited. No, get back. This is mine. <laughs> this is mine. See, and then that's why I said it could hook oh, yeah, to. Oh, yeah, it was right there. It could hook to this so you could drive on here. Yeah. Prepare. Oh my 90, 99. So now we need to read the instructions because I'm not quite sure how to. Prepare to update. Hook it up. How you hook it up? Oh, don't all of it be in Chinese? Oh, oh no. Okay. Oh no. What? Okay, oh, okay, here we go. No, it's all in Chinese, bro. The H. Oh, well, we gotta wait for the game to download before we can even play anything. But let me see. 
Connect the racing wheel with PS4 controller by USB cable, plug the USB of the racing wheel into the USB. Oh, okay. I know okay. it hurts tomorrow. It does. From far you take me away. She's feening on me, so I take her own. She build her up to get me in the zone. She's feening on me, so I take her own. Be all alone, she starts to moan. She know I like her tone. But not give her the bone. Yeah, she starts to moan. But not give her the bone. Be all alone, she starts to moan. Cause the god of my feet, twa, 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 twa. Roll the zoobie, let it burn, 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 burn. No more waiting, it's my time, time, time. Give him a double scoop up or whatever you need. Man. Oh. Speaking of that 40, I think you should have pulled it back, man. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Why do y'all have a big forehead? Oh my god. <laughs> Why do you need to put it right now? No. Queen or a black queen. Uh huh, murder you roll, you like Matt seeing. Pull the whip over and do stuff in the back seat. All I do is show you love and go and stab me. Baby girl, you know you wavy like you mass be. And you're always so worried about us girl use. Well, you should try a man on road and let it clap be. I mean, come and la 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 light up the ends. Really, I don't need to pretend. Man down when she lights up the skin. And we lie back and light up a bend. Hey, uh, let me get to know you better. Big no more flirting. I'm just. Y'all. So. Alright, as you can see, I just got finished doing um, Carter's hair, whatever. So we was getting ready to go. I'm looking real oily, ain't I? Uh, I was getting ready to. We was getting ready to go to his basketball game at. 6 30 is now 6 12. so it's gary go to his game and um they're supposed to be returning back to school tomorrow or whatever but i had to let the school know that i had um contracted the vid you know what i mean just trying to keep the kids safe and stuff you know doing what she's supposed to do so you just report it through this portal or whatever so she decides to call me today and lets me know carter can't come back to school tomorrow because of me having a bed and i was thinking like but i'm out of quarantine right like if i'm out of quarantine he has been tested the day that i was tested and he was tested negative why can't he come back to school why is that a problem but anyway he can't come back to school which makes me further think like he probably shouldn't go to a basketball game i said all that to say that so we're not going to the basketball game because if you can't even go to school tomorrow, seriously, though, you probably need to be at a basketball game, especially as it's break, you know, but just to make sure everybody else is okay and to protect his teammates as well as the people that he's playing against, you know, I didn't think it would be an issue with school. If it wasn't an issue with school, we'd be going to that game. But since even school said that he can't come back, I just feel like... I don't know. I don't know. What's up, peeps? How are y'all today? Welcome back. Or not welcome back. What's up? What's up, peeps? So today is Wednesday. It's Wednesday. I think the last time I talked to y'all was Monday. Carter wasn't going to uh, his basketball game due to the whole COVID thing and not letting him go back to school. But uh he's finally went back to school today his test came back negative yay so we're good to go so we're actually about to run a few errands the ones that we were supposed to actually do monday so it's wednesday but i had to le actually left y'all in the house and i was like oh let me go back and get them because we're gonna do this vlogging thing we're gonna we're gonna get together because i gotta bring y'all with me i mean even though we're not doing nothing serious but that's the whole point right <laughs> y'all still want to come right so come on <laughs> Anyway, alright guys, so um, I decided that my first store was going to be <laughs> Burlington Coat Factory because I'm going to take some stuff. Hey, that's why I need to lose some weight so I can actually like get back down to my bra size. 
you know, get it together because this don't make no sense. But anyway, so yeah, we're going back to Bros and Coat Factory. Um, I'm taking them back just because usually any other time I've been in, donated them or something. But I'm like, Tasha, stop doing that. I will have stuff that needs to be returned, have receipts, have it in the bag for months to the point where I'm tired of seeing it and I just donate it. When I could have either went and got my money back or got something that I actually was going to use. So it's 2022, so it's time to stop doing old things. Old things have passed away. New things are coming. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna start back taking stuff, returning things. It made no sense, but anyway, y'all see my eyes, right? So why didn't try to? just do lashes today like I have nothing on my face just bare face but I wanted some lashes on and I used the kiss hello you're nice sir I used the kiss uh liner lash glue eyeliner lash glue to put them on so I just kind of did like a cat eye or wing liner and I think I did it too thick or either I just had to get used to seeing myself with these on because to me, I just look, I don't know. I don't know, I just look different. I don't know, it's, like, it's almost like it makes my eyes look too heavy or too closed. I don't know. So maybe I should've did the liner thinner. Maybe I shouldn't've did the whole wing liner thing. So 2022, we're working, we're experimenting and seeing what works, because Maybe, I don't know. I feel like ever since I graduated and I took the corporate job, I didn't really wear makeup like that anymore. And you know, before that I was bartending all the way through college and all that. So I always, 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 always did my makeup because your face is everything. You're a server, you know, you bartend, you talk to people, like I gotta look cute. So, I mean, I did go to work sometime without makeup on, but for the most part, you wanna put some makeup on. Oh, oh. Hello? Yes, ma'am. Bye bye. <sighs> anyway, uh, what was I saying? Um, yeah, so when I had my corporate job or whatever, I really didn't wear makeup, but before that, when I was bartending and everything, but y'all seen that if y'all go back on some real old vlogs. But um, I always kept my face done, so now it's like, I gotta get back used to doing my face and kinda, I'm working on trying to figure out a, just an everyday routine, something that I can just throw on every day and kinda look cute and put together, even if I'm not going anywhere. So, you know, just to feel good about yourself, it just makes you, it makes me more productive. Like when I kinda get myself together, put some hair on. I'm always saying put hair on, but for real, put hair on. Don't pull out in front of me. What is wrong with people? Why can y'all not drive? I know you see me. All right, y'all, so I'm now in Burlington. But I'm just looking for some t-shirts. Looking for just like some graphic tees to wear like every day. I don't really see anything in the store. Oh, I could look for a planner. Oh, this is so cute. How cute is this, Mr. and Mrs. That'd be so cute for Jay and I, but we're not married yet, but still cute. I just came to return some things anyway, so I might as well leave with the money versus spending more. I was really just needing some t-shirts. Here's some. Nobody want no Taco Bell t-shirt. I guess I'm just gonna go on um, Pretty Little Thing and order me some. Just like everyday t-shirts. That's got Marilyn Monroe, that's kinda cute. Yes. Kinda cute. That's kinda cute. All right, well I'm gonna set through these shirts and yeah. 
No. All right, so I had to make a small detour, but um, I just came to one of my favorite sushi spots and I realized that there is a sneaker place next door. And it looks like they got some cute sneakers in there. So we're actually about to go look in there. But right now I'm at, I don't think you see it, Fuji's restaurant, but this is where I always get, well not always get, but this is one of my favorite sushi, spot, sushi spots when I first started eating sushi. They're just a little bit pricey, but I'm happy I came because look at those sneakers. <laughs> but anyway, so yeah, we about to go ahead and eat because they close at like two and they open back up at like five or something like that. So it's like, it's one o'clock now. And we gotta pick up Carter later. So we gonna go ahead and get in here. We gonna get one sushi roll and go next door. I did not know that was there. So y'all forgot to pick up the camera, but I picked up Carter from school. He got a little haircut on the side. Let's turn to the side. Turn around to the back. Stop trying to look at yourself. Yeah, he got a little haircut. So we're in Marshalls and I found Carter and I these two jackets alike. So we're gonna take some um pictures. Take some pictures. We're gonna set up our living room and do a photo shoot in our living room and outside. I'm thinking it would probably be um Fred, I'm gonna pull that video again. We'll probably do it like in a couple of weeks. I need to get our whole outfit together. I think we're gonna do black pants with it, white shirts, and yeah, you already have some black jeans. That's what I was thinking. So we're just walking around Marshalls. I was looking for a planner. Carter got me, or show them what you got in your hand. Show them. I got me a little laptop thing too. So I think that's all we found. I didn't see anything else. I was just looking around to see what I could find, but this Marshalls is completely empty. There is nothing in this store. So, yeah, we looked at just about everything. They don't have nothing like, hold on. The store is empty. Look at these shelves. Like, there's a ton of shelves like this over here. Like, there's nothing in this store. Like, Bruh. All right, so we are in Walmart. Y'all, look at look at the aisle. We're just doing a little bit of grocery shopping. But even if we was doing a lot, nothing. there is nothing in here. You want some fruit cups or something to take to school? There is nothing in the grocery store. I guess the grocery store going out of business, girl. They going out of business. Like, even the snack aisle is going to be like, I can't even find a red onion in this store. What? Uh, that, you know. Honey, what I don't they, know. What, what they do? Want to be no more food on this? Oh yeah, I did say that. Didn't I? <laughs> but yeah, so I we just got a little bit of stuff for tacos. We will grow our food. I can't, I ain't got my no green thumb, so I can't go nothing. So we just got a little bit of stuff for tacos. Oh, yeah, some tacos. And a few other little. Hey guys, my mom eats this. My they can't see you because I'm not eating a fruity pebble candy bar. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. How long I do this challenge for 24 hours? I'm going to make you eat. Oh, don't do that to me. <laughs> Alright, well, anyway, I just had to show y'all. Next, I'm gonna make you eat the toffee ways and then the blue toffee. Well, I just had to show y'all that the grocery store is completely empty, so I don't know if everybody's experiencing this, but y'all comment down below if y'all grocery stores are like mine, because it looks scary. It looks almost a little bit scary. I can't even lie. Yes, sir. So, I don't know what's going on. Anyway. Good morning, guys. So, today is Thursday. And you can see by the background, I'm actually at the beauty supply store. But, um, yeah, I just want to touch bases. <laughs> but I'm actually about to style this wig. They want to raffle this wig off. So I bleached it this morning. And so now we're about to pluck her out and get a better hairline to her. But, yeah, today we're not doing really too much of nothing. Carter has a basketball game today at like 6.30. 
I'll just be here working like 4.30. Um, I have people coming into my apartment about the, um, my apartment has been flooding like in my um, kitchen area for whatever reason I think is, I don't know. I don't know, but anyway, they're coming to fix that today. After lunch, but we're just gonna be here. Just wanna touch bases and say hello. Your girl is in the building, you know what I mean? But anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and pluck this hair out and then I will show y'all, let me give y'all a close up what she looks like now before I style her. You can see these knots were like huge, so they didn't bleach. I mean, they bleached, but they're still a little knotty looking, but she gonna look way better by the time I'm done. So yeah, I'm gonna sit here and pluck her out, listen to some music, watch a little bit of YouTube, enjoy my day. I hope y'all having a blessed Thursday and I'll see y'all in a few. I don't know when, but I'll see you later. All right, so I have finished the wig. I did very minimal baby hairs, but I'm about to go get my wig stand from home. She about to be cute. She about to be real cute. She cute or whatever. Alright guys, so it's like it's about to rain, but I have completed the wig. Completed that assignment. Complete the wig. I posted on Facebook and Instagram about the $20. It's going to be a $20 raffle by the time y'all see this. Mm, if y'all want to do, if y'all want to do raffles on this channel, let me know. Let me know. I figure out some kind of way, you know, to do something for my subbies, and, you know, because y'all my peoples. Y'all my peeps. That assignment is done. We're done. It is now two o'clock, so I have like 20 minutes before I go pick up Carter. So I'm gonna go ahead and head to Publix and go get me a sandwich. Uh, Bay wants one too, so I'm gonna just go ahead and get a foot long sandwich and take that back to him. And I'm gonna eat mine in the car ride line because I am so hungry. Like, hungry. We all, black is beautiful no matter what kind of black you are. Period. They want all our rhythm and none of our blues. You know what I mean? But, um. <laughs> enter, enter. People are going in. How do I enter? How do I enter? How do I enter? Yes. I'm about to hit you back up. So, people are. This is working. So, I'm actually doing this for the beauty supply store that I work at, honestly. Um. I do want to start help selling hair myself, but I feel like my mission right now is to help my friend get his store together and, you know, really get his business off the ground. I feel like God's going to bless me with my own through doing that for somebody else first, not being selfish, you know? So I'm just, you know, sitting patiently waiting my turn, but since he's already started and got his stuff together, um, I feel like I should just help him get his off the ground. So whatever it takes, you know, styling wigs or whatever, because I'm not charging him for that, which I should be, but I'm not because I feel like this is what God is telling me to do. So anyway, yeah, I'm sorry, Emily. I'm excited because he was starting to enter. <laughs> All right, I'm going to get my sandwich.